<laughs> Someone asked, would you go to the strip club with your man? I done been there, done that a million times. I don't see there being a problem with a woman going to the strip club with her man unless he is dead with his homies. I mean, I don't know how if I want her to give me a lap dance or anything. I don't know how close I want to be to the stage with the pussy juices flying with me and stuff. I don't know how I feel about that. But you know, for him, you know what I'm saying? If that's what he wants, he wants me to accompany him. I'm his friend. You know, I might as well go. But a lot of the times, that's just places for men. I don't want to step into the zone where a man needs to take his private time and his private space to become whatever it is so he can be 100% to come into our relationship being okay. Like a lot of people lose their identity inside of relationships and being an individual inside of their relationships. Like it's important that you be an individual. It's important that you go do whatever it is that you need to do in order to come back into this relationship and make it go smooth so if you need to go to the strip club knock it out now would I go with you sure but you know I'm kind of hmm, I'm a little different you know what I'm saying like I've had threesomes and stuff like you know I'm not the kind of woman that uh, is like stuck on like old traditional things I'm I'm old-fashioned a little bit like I'll do anything for my man like I'm very submissive and I'm very in tune and into my relationship when I am in a relationship and I'm very understanding and I like to talk things through and work shit out and be there for my dude and stuff like that going to the strip club is as easy as one two three like I said this in a previous video that a lot of women don't like to show their freaky side. They don't like to have threesomes and go to the strip club with their man because a lot of men don't respect women who do that. It's like you guys want women to be like this, but at the same token, you don't respect women that open up themselves sexually to you. These are not women that you're ending up being with. You're ending up pushing them to the side and end up marrying some woman that you barely uh, satisfied sexually with. So, you know, women are afraid to, you know, be that woman to hop on top of a man and take him and give him all kinds of sexual pleasures and to tell a man what they like sexually like I like to watch I'm one of those people where I like to watch a man having sex it's strange it's like I like to watch my man and if he's having sex with someone else I'll just look and be like mm, look good look at him and I'll be looking at him the whole time but when he's having sex with me I can't see him unless we're in a mirror or something but nine times out of ten we're not in the mirror unless they're on the ceiling so you know I like to watch and that is like very private information that I'm telling you guys but don't judge me so anyway that's the kind of stuff that I like and I like a lot of other things sexually and I don't mind doing those things with my man now other men uh, you know what I'm saying like I'm good like I'm not a promiscuous woman but I am extremely freaky and I feel like it's okay for me to be like that. A lot of that information and a lot of those experiences that any person has needs to stay private and those are the things that you need to do for your man. Not doing it on TV and all that other stuff. That's why I don't have no respect for no porn star because I feel like whatever it is that you do sexually with someone is a way for you to connect with another human being and that's something that needs to be private and not something for the whole world to see. You know, it's important that everybody understands one thing like what you want sexually and what you want to do uh, with your man, do that shit. You know, do it. If you lose him, he wasn't meant for you to, to begin with. You know, a lot of women are afraid to do kinky shit. Do that kinky shit. Okay? Love it, too. And if you don't like it, then that's not the man for you. You want a man that love you all around. And if you freak you with it, and he don't love it, that means something wrong with him. You know what I'm talking about? I still can't understand why a man would cheat on a woman that has threesomes with him. But it's happened to me. So... <laughs> And people say, how do uh, per how do you cheat on someone that you have in threesomes with? Because everybody has their specific rules and requirements inside of a relationship. One of my rules was, listen, uh, we can do this whole threesome stuff if you want to, but make sure you only do this with me. Don't step outside of our relationship and go sleep with the woman without me. That's my only rule. Just don't do that and let me pick the girl. That's all I said. <laughs> said that was my rule. He broke that rule, so he cheated. That's what cheating means. So. Everybody has like a specific rule and thing that they put on a relationship and um, some people consider threesomes cheating. Like it just depends on the couple, it depends on that specific person. I can tell you what I can and cannot deal with and what I cannot deal with is a man lying to me about who he's sleeping with. Now if he's sleeping with a woman and he's interested in that girl in a sexual nature, he should be able to tell me that and how I want to deal with it from that point on matters. That point on should be respected. So unless he, if he breaks that rule then, 
no relationship. And a lot of men break that, those rules, especially I know women got rules when they go to the strip club with a man. You know what I'm saying? I, I'll have a rule if I went to the strip club with my man. Like, if we experiencing it, this together, we're going to have some limitations. If you want to do what you want to do in the strip club, I suggest you go by yourself. Because um, I am about to be sitting up here watching anything happen with my man. Come on now, stop it. Hey, you got any topics you want to talk about? Anything! What you want me to make a video about? Whatever you want! People love when I talk about sex, love, and relationships. But if there's anything that you want to discuss, you just let me know, okay? Hey, if it's funny and entertaining, I'll do it. Send me a message at welovesanseray at gmail.com. Or you can text, call me, or leave a voicemail at 678 856 Three, four, six, three. This is my favorite hobby in the world. I love making YouTube videos. So whatever you want to talk about, please suggest. Please comment, like, subscribe, share. Thank you for the support. I really appreciate it. Have vision and stay focused. Bye.